Nicola Badalana from PixieHill.com with a Midsummer Fairy Theater. For more information and complete supply list, visit the blog linked in the description. Give the stage floor a good coat of acrylic paint. Assemble the backdrop and paint the color of a twilight sky. A bit of glue will hold a sprinkling of glitter in place. Then the bottom and top come together. The curtains and swags are glued. I skim the surface with some spackling. This will hide the notched edges and add texture. Once dried, I'll sand the surface not quite smooth. To create a crackled aged look, cover the surface with a healthy layer of white glue. While it is still wet, add a coat of acrylic paint. If you look carefully, you'll see the cracks begin to appear as it dries. Once completely dry, washes of blue, black, and brown are applied to the exterior. With a Xyron sticker maker, I give my trims an adhesive backing. Brass stars and embellishments are added. I've cut some small branches from the garden and am brushing the tips with glue before dipping them in glitter. Now to set the scene. I'm adding pieces of sheet moss to the interior. Then the frosted glistening forest is glued into place. Dainty paper roses, pine cones, leaves, and little toadstools are added.
A glittery moon and fancy feet complete the stage. An extra dash of glitter. A paper fairy queen takes her place. Golden damselflies hide in the branches. Tis almost fairy time. <laughs>